We're back. It's Cortia Media Marketing Podcast, and this week we're talking all things Twitter. Naz, why are we talking about Twitter? Uh, well, Twitter, there's so many good things about Twitter, but the main thing I would say is that it lets you engage with your, brand, your customers. Okay, but how does it do that? Um, it lets you listen to what they actually want, um, what they like about your company, what they like about the industry, how they feel about your brand. Okay, and can Twitter help you express who your brand is? Yeah, because Twitter, you can you can literally do whatever you want on Twitter. You can express your uh, your personality, your tone of voice. All right, and um, is Twitter a fast way to get the message out? Um, assuming your target audience is on Twitter, which they probably are, then yeah, it is. Okay, for what kind of things? If, if I was trying to use Twitter from a branding, marketing perspective, what type of things could I use Twitter for? So, for example, if you have a special promotion, or a new product or service that's launching, you use it for that. All right, and then what about networking and using Twitter for that? Uh, well, Twitter, you can find almost um, any aspect of your business that you're looking for. For example, if you're looking to hire someone, mm-hmm. um, if you're looking to source products. All right, so there's different opportunities there. And now, um, the, the main reason I think all of us especially in the marketing world, say that you should be on Twitter is because, let's be honest, all your business competitors are on it. Um, you know, everybody who's looking for your type of product or your business will do a compulsory, you know, Twitter search, but also don't even think about it that way. Dell, HP, AT&T, Microsoft, Apple, uh, 74% of the Fortune 500 companies were on it in 2013, and now if you look at the Fortune 500 companies, now in 2017, the numbers are somewhere around 85, 90%. Twitter is a crucial part of your marketing structure. It should be something that you're doing. Now, using Twitter can be tedious, mm-hmm. can be time consuming, um, creating and generating new content, posting at the correct time, uh, engaging with the right people, and for that, if you don't have the time and you're a small business owner, feel free to send us an email at info at cortiamedia.com and we can handle that for you. And for all your other social media needs, why not just follow us on Twitter at Cortia Media. We'll get back to you if you slide into our DMs. Matt, anything else you can say about Twitter before we cut out today? Um, just make sure you're on Twitter. Make sure you create your profile properly. Um, you're updating regularly. Don't just post once in a blue moon. Uh, people like to see some consistency. All right. Well... That was all for this week's truncated episode of the Cortia Media Marketing Podcast. Thank you for listening. Be sure to go to the Apple Store and leave us a review uh, and subscribe so each Monday you can hear what we're talking about. Be sure to check out all our social media channels this week as we will be highlighting Twitter. And again, to get a hold of us, feel free to send an email, info at CortiaMedia.com or find us on the web at CortiaMedia.com.